Seasons Greetings viewers. Hi, welcome back to my channel. John with you, Kaiwaza. It is the day after Christmas and I am enjoying my Christmas blend tea from Timothy's Irish Cream. If it will focus. Anyway, that's what I'm drinking. And I also put in a little bit of um, pumpkin caramel scones, uh, simply, what do they call that syrup? Anyway, sugar-free syrup. It's good. Ross has been getting a lot of those uh, in lately, those sugar-free syrups, and every Ross I go to lately, I've been getting a couple and stocking up, and I have my own little hoard of them, I think about 10 bottles that I'm sort of in different flavors all saving because they don't always carry those things. Um, TJ Maxx has them sometimes also, but they don't always have them. Um, so I'm just kind of grabbing some here and there wherever I see them and building a little stockpile of it because I love this stuff in my tea and in my coffee, different flavors. It's $3.99 a bottle. It's a good deal. Okay, so... Well, if you're a Bath and Body Works person, you know what today is. If uh, not, uh, I'll just say that uh, I took the pilgrimage to Mecca today. <laughs> and it's the beginning of the semi-annual sale at Bath and Body Works, where there are tables, at least one table, sometimes many tables, of things that are 75% off, sometimes 50% off and other sales going on. So it's kind of the time when, uh, if you do things the way I do, uh, that you stockpile. It's that time when you get a lot of products at a very, very much lower price than they normally are and just stockpile it. Um, I don't stockpile the, the body creams and lotions anymore because I know they do kind of go bad after a couple of years or whatever. So, And I have a bunch now, so I'm just using those. I'm not going to buy any more of those. Candles, I'm okay on right now. Um, they're, right now, the, the candle sale is $11.95 each, which is about the best it's going to get. I'm not crazy about that price point. I know it's half more than half off, but still, I'm just like, mm, I don't know. So, uh, I wasn't really looking for candles. What I And I wasn't really looking for hand soaps because I also have a lot of hand soap. I probably have like 20 or more uh, bottles of hand soap. So, I don't, that's not an emergency. Neither is little, little hand sanitizers. I have 15,000 of those that I've gotten on sales and uh, I just don't need to get any more right now. Uh, so what I was going there for was, uh, uh, what you call it? Shower gels. Unbeknownst to me, I'd been using them and was kind of on a use it up project with them for a while and, and using them for various things and whatever. And I just discovered recently that I only have three, uh, bottles of shower gel left, which in to a Bath and Body Works hoarding person. Um, you know, to a normal person, that's like, well, my gosh, you're one person. How much do you need? Three bottles probably last you three months, which is probably true. But um, for me, being that low, it's like the emergency sirens go off, you know? <laughs> like, oh my God, you're down to three. <laughs> so... I was there, waited through the line, and so I was on a mission today. I didn't. I spent less time in the store than I spent in the line. I was in the line about half an hour, which was not bad, and I was in the store probably 20 minutes because I went in focused on shower gels that were 75% off. That's what I was interested in. And then I would just look around, and if there was anything else, I would get it, but I was focused on the shower gel. So I did, I went to the 75% off table and I grabbed one of everything that was on, of shower gel that was on the 75% off table. Then I went to the 495 body care table and I took, I don't, I don't know if I got one of everything, but I took almost at least one of everything from that 495 table. So all the shower gels I got were either 312 or 337, depending on their price point, original price point, or 495 from that 495 table. But they're 
all in the area of like $13.50 or so a piece, which is crazy, y'all. Really, do you pay that? I would never pay that for shower gel. I mean, I love their stuff, but $13.50. Um, so no. So let me show you what I got. Um, I will preface it by saying I did get one candle because after I looked at the shower gels and I grabbed, looked at the 75% off, I, I did go past the candles a little bit thinking maybe in the back of my head, maybe there was something I had wanted that I didn't get that we didn't have in the store before. And since it was $11.95, I might as well get one today. And there was one that when I had seen people reviewing it and talking about it, I wanted to get and our store did not have it at the time. So today I did pick one candle up for $11.95, which is this one, white velvet cupcake with really pretty wax sort of a Christmassy design. I don't really consider this scent Christmassy necessarily. Uh, white velvet cake, coconut shavings, white buttercream with essential oils. I mean, to me, if you live in Hawaii, you know what I'm talking about. This really smells like, uh, like a haupia cake, which is a coconut pudding and white layer cake with like a coconut pudding on it. It's kind of what it smells like. It smells really good. So I did get that one. And I did get three uh, hand soaps because they did have some on the 75. Not many, but they had a few kinds on the 75% off table, which made them only $1.88. So I did pick up these three. If they have a more, if they put more out I hear of different hand soaps for 75% off, I will get some more and stockpile it. Uh, but it's going to have to be 75% off. I think mean, 50% is not enough for me to buy a bunch of this. But I did get Bamboo Paradise. I didn't smell these at all. I just grabbed things, you know. Because um, I know I like everything pretty much anyway. And this is, <laughs> this is really nice, this one. Dewy Ivy Musk and Blonde Sandalwood. I might get some more of those later if they still... That's a really nice scent. I got Fiji White Sands and I got Mango Mai Tai. So, and I think they had maybe one or two other kinds. I don't know, but very limited on the 75% off hand soap. And that's not really what I was looking for anyway. On to what I was looking for, which is the shower gel. So I'm not going to go through everything. I mean, I'm not going to talk in depth about each one, but we're going to go look and see because I got, how many did I get? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. I got 15 of them. Like I said, I like to stockpile it when it's 75% off. Get it in quantity because it doesn't go bad. I know the body creams only last a couple years or whatever. <coughs> and they turn. You can actually use them after they turn, but they're not as pleasant. But this stuff, I think, will last through the apocalypse or the end of the world or 2050, whichever comes first. I don't know. Fresh sparkling snow, frozen melon, winter apple, sun drop blossom, frosted musk. I got cactus blossom. I should say, also, I did not smell these in the store either. Bright cactus petals blended with sun-kissed coconut and vanilla. Um, I like all of their shower gels pretty much. I'm not really picky about scents. I just love scent in general. And for something like this, like a shower gel, I like that they smell when you're using them, but they don't really linger on your body. So it's not like you're, you're out of the shower and dry it off and going about your day and you're smelling like cactus blossom. You know, you can use your own colognes or scents or whatever. Um, this does not really stay on your body, which is fine with me. Um, somehow I got two of these. This was a mistake, but that's okay. Uh, frosted cranberry. Snow-dusted cranberries. Juicy peach. Ripe red raspberry. Happy New Year, everyone. Wouldn't you like 2021 to be filled with relaxing and lovely music? Music from the golden age of songs. Tune in to Moody Mood Music on Live365.com and you'll be serenaded by easy listening records of decades past. It's just what you need for 2021. I'll see you there. That's Moody Mood Music. The link is below in the description. Frosted Coconut Snowball. Nothing says Christmas like coconut. 
right? I mean, who decided that? Frosted Coconut North Pole Vanilla, like, it's not regular vanilla. Winter Frasia, not that annoying Spring Frasia. This is Winter Frasia. Snow Kissed Woods Spun Sugar. It smells good. I don't know that it smells like what it says, though. I don't smell any coconut. It smells more like, uh, yeah, Frasia. I get the Frasia. I get a wood note. And it's uh, slightly sweet, but I don't get any coconut. North Pole Vanilla, I don't know. Maybe North Pole Vanilla doesn't smell. I don't know. Snowflakes and Cashmere. This one, uh, the mythology on this one is Vanilla Cashmere Cream Caramel Woods Frosted Clementine. <coughs> anyway, as I was saying, I don't smell them in the store. I'm just like, oh, if I don't have that one, I just grab it. Grab it, grab it. At this price, because they're all either, you know, $3 or $4.95. Gingerbread Latte, love that one. And I'll use them any time of the year. I don't care if it's holiday scent. I don't care if it's like a really feminine scent. I don't care. Like, I just, I love the scents and... I use it in the shower and whatever. I like it. Champagne apple honey. Sensual amber. Golden amber, wild berries, orange flower, lotus petals, creamy sandalwood. How is sandalwood creamy? Can you explain that to me? Like... You know, smells like amber. Where do you know? Champagne toast. You know, for the longest time, I'm going to make a confession about this. <laughs> this scent has been around in candles and body care and everything for a long time. Uh, it's obviously, I thought for the longest time, and I don't think I even really quite realized it until this year, because I don't think I'd ever gotten the scent in anything, that I was just kept thinking, that's so weird, like a piece of toast and champagne, champagne toast. Do you dip this toast in champagne or what are they talking about? <laughs> I don't know, it's somehow I realized recently like, oh my God, oh my God. Yeah, like a toast with champagne, what am I thinking? <laughs> Immerse yourself in a world, uh, what's it say? Oh, pop, clink, okay. Fragrance notes are way down on this one. Pink champagne, black currant, chambord, sparkling nectarine, and sugar musk. That does smell kind of like champagne. Yeah, it does. Waikiki Beach Coconut. How appropriate. Here we are in Waikiki. Tropical white coconut, saltwater breezes, sun bleached woods. Bora, Bora. Citrus Surf White Pumpkin and Chai I think we can figure that one out Another one that's sort of self-explanatory Coconut Hibiscus And finally Pink Coconut Calypso Which is supposed to be Coconut Water Seaside Frasia As opposed to Winter Frasia Sunkissed Lily, Apple Driftwood. Okay. All those apple trees that fall into the ocean and become apple driftwood. I definitely get some apple in that. That's a nice one, very fresh smelling. Okay, that's what I got. My grand total was seventy six eighty nine. So for what would have been a hundred and two dollar hundred and seventy two dollar discount. <laughs> would have been crazy anyway 76 90 89 that's what i got that is my semi-annual sale haul i'll probably go again just to check it out but it'll be a little while several days and see if maybe they put out some different things on 75 percent off oh, and, and if hand soaps go if a bunch of hand soaps go 75 i'll pick up some more of those too and some more shower gels if i don't have them but i kind of got a lot today i think i got enough anyway we'll talk to you later